dog, you blew up, dog. Oh, How do you, you feel about your fame, dog? It's, I you're got getting to... late. You're getting late, huh? I, I got... ah! <laughs> hey, cuts, cuts, again, cuts. Like cuts. I'm going to go in again. All right, so second round, huh? Yeah. Is that how you do it? I mean, man, I go for second rounds. Third round? Yeah, even six, yeah? <laughs> yeah, man. very aggressive, uh, my sister. Man, I know, even, even in bed, my brother. <laughs> <laughs> what was like the big? What was the the biggest blessing you ever got from a guy? Thirty thousand rand. Surprisingly, came out. Wow, guys, but I never let my dreams. Be dumb. You guys don't know, but Botswana, a lot of Botswana men have money a lot. The problem is, the others they can't express it. They can't flex. So, are you here with your girlfriend tonight? Bye, bye. <laughs> <laughs> You better know we got the flavor as juice. Right, City B Dub, Africa, the rest of the world. What's going on? It's your boy TK. And welcome to another episode of another banger of another episode of another banger of. You already know, it's the Juice 2.0. And thank you so much for stopping by. Returning subscriber, what's going on, y'all? Your family. And I love you so much. Appreciate you, bottom of my heart, man. Somewhere in my bones. And if you haven't subscribed, hey, do the right thing. Help us grow by clicking subscribe. And then the family grows, the Juice 2.0. I'm over here at the Vineyard Lounge. That's right. The Vineyard Yard uh, Lounge over in Massa. As they launch this new amazing restaurant, man. New amazing restaurant right in the CBD. I know you guys have been suffering. It's been a lot of scarcity when it comes to amazing spot that you can come to. But the Vineyard is here. And today I'm honored to be part of the people that gets to introduce the Vineyard Lounge to you and so in the comment section let me know exactly how you're feeling because i gotta be personal with you genuinely how are you i'm sitting here with one of the djs that blessed us so very well man with amazing music some r&b and some hip-hop right here at the vineyard lounge launch yeah it's gonna be a problem tonight because the english might just launch and lounge ah comrade <laughs> <laughs> comrade launch and lounge ah, yeah babe, you not, know what the danger it's is not, ah, it's giving zimbabwe <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. I need you to put your hands together and help me welcome DJ Bunny. What's shout happening, out, son? Shout out. Ah, great, 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 bro. Yeah. Yeah. How you doing? Um, I'm awesome. I'm awesome, bro. Dog, yeah. I loved your set so much. What time did you start playing? What time did you finish? I think I, I started playing around um, 7 o'clock, 7 p.m. But it wasn't my time. I was just um, supposed to be like filling in the blanks for those uh, the ones that didn't come early. Ne? Oh, so the DJs that didn't come? Yeah, like they, were, they didn't come well in time. So like yeah. the, one for the team, obvious. <laughs> yeah. Are you always a punctual DJ though? Because okay. I, I know always. with DJs, uh, you have time sets that you have to play. Are you always punctual? Always, I'm always punctual. Oh, even like arrive an hour early yeah. for my set. So that I sit down, see what's going on. And then, you know what? Yeah. The vibes, just see the vibes for what's going on. Yeah. Yeah. How do you how do you measure a good set as DJ Bunny? What are some of the things you look at and you say, you know what, I was successful tonight? You know what? Um, to me, a good set is just determined by the crowd, eh? Yeah. Like a, you can, it's, it's just a matter of. Yeah, um, I think those ladies are screaming for you, though. Ah, uh, shout out, bro! Hey, yo, <laughs> shout out, DJ Bunny! <laughs> yeah. So I think it's just a matter of just you know analyzing the crowd, see right. how they feel, their mood, because you know what, you just can't. Always be there, like some people will just come here to just have some food here. Yeah? For sure. Yeah. For sure. Just, just have some food, relax. Just a matter of just calculating the crowd. Okay, fine, bro. It's still early. Yeah. You yeah. can just it's rush still, to still, those. Wait, wait, wait. It's half eight right now. Is it still too early? Yeah, it is. It is. No. It is. Okay, it so is. what's late? What's late? I mean, like we have some peak hours, bro. Peak hours, like. I'm not used to this life, bro. <laughs> it's a, like, you know what? Being a DJ, yeah. it's a calling, eh? So you just have to be there well in time, see how the, the, the mood of the crowd the is. The yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you can't you. pitch up right now and then you just rock some. And then yeah. be a rock star just like that. I feel you. you. Know? Yeah, So yeah, with yeah. that criteria, man, however you look at how successful you become, were you successful tonight? Did you th Do you think you did good tonight with your set? I'll tell you how I feel about your set. But well, that wasn't, that wasn't my set. I was just, you know, 
filling in the blanks like so are you still coming Elia back on. yeah i'm rocking Actually, what time are you coming back um around eight no nine to ten nine to ten we're rocking oh, we're operating oh, yeah shit. dude you were telling me you started djing 11 years ago yes yeah have you grown or you feel you feel there are certain areas as a dj that you still need to grow on well bro i'm growing every day because yeah. you know what so far i can say that i'm proud of myself because you know i've been loving this shit bro like yeah, for a very yeah. long time i yeah. loved it since way back because for sure. I didn't just wake up and then I was like, okay, fine, I'm going to be a DJ. <laughs> but I just loved it from day one. Yeah. Who taught you how to DJ? Myself. No oh, one taught me how to DJ. Because yeah. this is what happened, eh? Yeah. Um, my brother was staying in the, was staying in Canada. Okay. Ne? He yeah. came with a laptop, ne? And then he, he had this, this um, visual DJ thing, ne? Yeah. And then I looked at it and I was like, okay, fine, since I love music, why don't I just give this thing a shot? And then I did it, learned how to use the CD players, CDJs, everything. Yeah. Because why? I love music. I love that, man. Yeah. Is your girlfriend here tonight? She's not around tonight. Yeah. Oh, where's she at? She's in Francis Town. Oh, yeah. long distance relationship? Bro, yeah. <laughs> yo, 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 hey, yo, yo, yo. <laughs> yo, it's going down, bro. It's rough, huh? Yeah, it's rough. It's I rough. know, I know. Yeah, but not rough like that, but... It's a very nice experience because it's just says your le like loyalty levels. Like, oh, okay, yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. How can you go? How long can you go with your partner? Stuff like that. You're yeah. a blessed brother. Tell you what, I can't wait for your set coming up, man. Because I already, I already enjoyed the little bit that you showed us early on. Are you ready to dance? I'm. Oh, I'm ready to dance for sure. Because you know, I'm not boasting, but you know what? I'm actually one of the good DJs around, bro. Like, you know. You heard it from him. Yeah. And you I know think what? I can you back can it even up. bet mine right now. Like, you know. Give me 10k right now, and then I can show you that. You wanna go for it? Yeah. Yeah. He probably wants to. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Please put it up, <laughs> DJ Bunny. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're still sitting over here at Vineyard Lounge, located at Massa, right at the back of Massa, but in between Massa and the Ministry of Justice, right? This is the Ministry of yeah, Justice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ministry of Just Justice. Just in between there, that's where you find the Vineyard Lounge. And I'm pleased here to be sitting with the owner of Vineyard Lounge. I need you to put your hands together and help me welcome Oscar Chuma. Say hi to Oscar. What's going on, Chuma? Po, 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 po. <laughs> Yo, congratulations, man. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. Today yeah. is the launch of yeah. Vineyard Lounge. Yeah, we're launching. We're launching the brand, bro. How you feel? How you feel tonight? Dude, I feel big, man. Like, yeah, I'm launching the biggest brand. <laughs> the future. You understand? The future. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm launching the future, bro. The future. I love it, no man. No doubt. No how, doubt. How long, how long has this day been coming up? Like, Take me through when you concepted this whole thing to tonight. How long has it been? Hey, man, you know, uh, the first time I approached the, the, the mall management was way back before COVID, eh? Before COVID? Yeah, yeah. I came here, I checked the place out, I brought some uh, uh, two, three architectures to come yeah. check it out for me. Yeah. Then I consulted with the council, yeah. uh, the licensing authority. Yeah. I consulted with the marketing guys. Right, right. Yeah, man, I put them together. Then I, I also had to consult my instincts. <laughs> then they told me, hey, like, go, go for ahead, it. Go, go for ahead. it, man. Yeah, but you know, the more management didn't believe in it, eh? Oh. Yeah, but I had to convince them. Okay. Yeah. Uh, through my experience, I had to use the right ways. Yeah. I had to do drawings. I had to do like a 3D, you understand? Oh! Yeah, like a proper 3D and say, look, this is how it's gonna look. This is how it's gonna look. They were like, hey, it's like sentence, <laughs> nigga. You understand? I did that. I did all that. I spent money. Yeah, and of I course, spent of money course. before I even, I was even given an, uh, an offer later and said, no, oh, look. Yeah. yeah, now we can consider you. I went through an interview. These yeah. guys are so professional, man. They just, just don't just give space to anyone. They don't oh, trust. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They don't understand. They don't know his financial background. You need to have a financial, sound financial. Yeah, for uh, you to set up. Yeah, you okay, understand? Okay. Yeah, so at the end of the day, yeah. We're here now. I'm, yeah, man. We're here now. I'm, yeah, would yeah. You, would you describe the process as difficult or it's, it's easy? Yeah, the whole process? Uh, I'd say it's easy, but it's difficult. It needs patience. You don't need to give up, man. You can't give yeah, up, man. You know, you book a meeting with someone, then they tell you, no. Yes, meeting is confirmed. Next time you are there waiting for them, then they don't turn up. Then you don't just have to give up. Yeah. Don't lose hope. Yeah. Book another one. I get keep that. Keep pushing. Keep pushing up until 
You get what you want. You get so, it. So why was this location specifically important to you? Because you know what? What I want to commend to you, though, honestly, and congratulate you on, is to picture something I never had in my mind. Like, I never thought, like, the back strip of Masa would have a restaurant, right? But for you, why was this spot the spot for you? Okay, not necessarily the part, okay. but uh, the location as the CBD. CBD, yeah. CBD is growing, bro. For sure. Yeah, business uh, buildings are being erected and uh, it's developing. It's so fast, yeah? It's yeah. growing fast. Yeah. We got malls that are coming in. We got, like, uh, the good clientele best. The corporate, you understand? Yeah, yeah. yeah, they are coming. They are moving from all these malls and 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 industrial locations. They are coming to the CBD. Right, right, right. So it right. can make sense to call it a CBD, and CBD is corporate. And I'm actually wanna go corporate. Oh yeah, you yeah, get yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. yeah go, I, go. I'm running bars in the mainstream. I'm um, Tane, White City, Broadway. Yeah, yeah. You're now, actually, you're actually tap, handling a lot of things. Yeah, yeah. I'm not yeah. tapping the corporate. So okay. yes, uh, Master Center was the ideal spot for me like uh yeah no here let me see how it goes but i'm confident i'm gonna make it <laughs> you know so tonight tonight is the launch right yes sir. but you've already been operating for uh, is it a week or two now this is our third week third week yeah this is our third week how's business how's business Bruh, so the far? response is good man it's awesome it's Hey, dog, man. it's packed over here, Dude, dog. No. Hey, you know what, bro? Hey, yo. God is great, man. <laughs> I don't lie to you. God is great, man. Sure. Like, hey, sure. man, God is always in my back, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, for real, I got friends. I got my circle of friends. Yeah, yeah. I can survive just on my circle of friends. My friends bring their other friends and friends, and that's how you build. Be nice to your friends, you understand? Be nice to your friends. Be nice to your friends. They will save you. I don't do, like, aggressive marketing and, you know, like, I have to go to the moon and back to make it happen. You, get, you understand? I feel you. I just got friends. I just share my flyer, tell them my ideas. I look, guys, I'm up and running. Joel over. They just come. All of a sudden, the place is full. And people will be like, how does this guy do it? Friends. Friends, friends are important. But also... Friends, my nigga. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. For, thank you for paying the Juice 2.0 to you come here. You yeah? included. <laughs> you included. Tell, tell, tell them to pay the Juice 2.0, yeah. all right? Yeah. yeah like, yo, you hey, need to. Don't subscribe. just call... <laughs> You need to subscribe, guys. You need to. You understand? So, yeah. so Chuma, we're about to wrap up, right? What are you looking forward to with this place, man? What do you want to achieve out of this spot? Yeah, you know, um, bro, my dream is to run a nightclub, exclusive nightclub. I've consulted with the center management. Sure. I've, 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 I've been offered a space. So I want to grow my clientele and my operation time to a.m., you understand? Right, right. I open at 8 o'clock, I close at 12, people move into the, the nightclub, to the nightclub, they leave yeah, yeah, yeah. at 6 in the morning. Okay. So I'm building a clientele that I want to keep until 6 a.m. I like you that. You get it? I like that. The club is coming. Watch the space. Exclusive. The best club coming over. Bro, trust me, you see it. I, I got you. Yeah, I yeah, got you. yeah, yeah. Bro, I appreciate you so much for bringing us here. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so much for making the Juice 2.0 part of your, your life story. Congratulations for tonight, motherfucker! Yeah! yeah. Motherfucker too! <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Chuma, owner of Vineyard Lounge, right here in the CBD. What the motherfucker, man? <laughs> alright, 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 alright. So you remember I talked to one of the DJs over here at the Vineyard Lounge? The launch of this restaurant, amazing place in CBD, right at the back of Massa. But hey, Look what the cat dragged in. <laughs> another DJ. I'd be DJ Khaled right now and say <laughs> another one. Another one. <laughs> She's phenomenal. She's a female DJ right here in BW making the waves. Everybody been booking her. And it's not for no good reason. She's really hot on the ones and twos. I need you to put your hands together for my sister. <laughs> DJ Earth. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. What up, sis? Good man, how you doing? How you, I'm great, man. How I'm you doing? I'm awesome. Yeah. So I was asking you, like, did you play already? Yeah, I did. Fudge. <laughs> I, was, I think I was working. Now I'm gonna when you go played. again. Like I'm gonna go in again. All right. So second round, huh? Yeah. Is that how you do it? I mean, man, I go for second rounds. Third round. Yeah, even six. Yeah. <laughs> I go for the sixth round. <laughs> yes. Shut the girls, what? But but can the brothers hold up though? Six rounds? Now it depends if you're Zimbabwean. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be fucking zero for me, brother. If you're Zimbabwean, you can hold up? Yeah. 
I'm Zimbabwe, man. I, I, I don't know about you, sir. I've had but... two, two good rounds. <laughs> and, I'm, and I'm Zimbabwean. After that, I'm like, okay, baby, do your thing. So are you Shona? I'm Shona, yeah. Oh, okay. But anyway, tell me about your set, man. How do you feel about that? Um, I felt amazing. Mm -hmm. I did what I could do best. I mean, I killed it. Yeah? Yeah. So how, how long have you been DJing? It's been two years now. Yeah. It's been two years. And you're booked the way you're booked? Yeah. How is that even possible? It's possible. Look, okay, okay. I'm going to be a little controversial, right? All right. Do you feel people book you for your talent or they book you because you're female and you're a DJ? Um, I feel like they book me because of my talent. Okay. Yeah. Not because you're a lady, Not yeah? because I'm a lady. Okay. Yeah. I've heard you play, by the way. Yeah. You're quiet. You're quiet. Yeah, hard. man, I, I mean, I mean, come on. I, I asked DJ Bunny who taught him how to DJ. He said he was self-taught. Who taught you how to DJ? Um, I went to, I went to school, actually. I actually graduated. Um, the school is in Block 5. It's called YDJ Academy. That's oh. where I went to school. I even have a certificate. Like, I'm just Yo, like that. Do you that. have Nika on your, on your set? Come on, Nika. No, I don't blame Nika, Nika for what? Nika. I like taking people back. So, so your hip-hop, R&B. Yeah, yeah. I'm a hip-hop and R&B 2000 coming up. Yeah. Shit. That's hard. Yeah, very. So, so is it a problem sometimes when you're trying to get to a spot like this, right? Mm -hmm. And you're playing that kind of music in an environment where people are just trying to look for me. Is you it tough for do? you? You know what I do? What it's do you not do? tough. Okay. Because I see, you know, there's TK. Uh, TK can vibe to this music. <laughs> so I'm going to pull this. Yeah, so I'm going to pull this. So, like, literally, um, so, I just I just play. When I just look at the crowd, I'm like, nah. But yeah. I'm not going to get them with them more, you know? So the, the genre is not going to die, yeah? Nah, it's not. It's, it's not, not going to die. It can't die, yeah. It's a few of you guys doing that, yeah? Yeah. How many names can you mention of the DJs that are playing R&B and hip-hop? I don't know nobody. I only know DJ Earth. <laughs> hey, talk your shit. Yeah, talk man. your shit. Oh, by the way, TK, do you know I'm in the Yamas? Best DJ. Ow! I've been nominated. Ow! Yeah. Oh, shit. Best DJ. You're nominated with who? Um, Yarn FM. Yeah, I mean, oh, like, with, who else? I have DJ Bunny. Bunny. I have the FME DJ. FME. I have DJ Kali. Kali. The others, I'm sorry. I don't remember, you know but I mean? yeah. <laughs> You're so full of shade. I can't You're relate. so shade, no, bro. Not even, man. But, but congratulations, I mean, man. Thank you so, so, so much. Because I think the Yama Awards nominations, that's a big deal. I'm very proud of myself. I'm proud of you. I've been pushing, man. Yeah. I'm doing this for my kids. Yeah. I'm doing this for my mom and dad. So yeah. I'm really proud. You say man. kids? Yeah, I How have many two you kids. Got? I have two kids. Oh. Yeah. Damn. I have Michelle and Malik. Michelle and? Malik. Malik? Yeah. I know that that's poor dog. <laughs> Michelle and Malik. Malik, yes. It's but Malik is a beautiful name though. Yeah, it is. Malik is it a means beautiful kings name. Kings of Kings. Oh shit. So that's the purpose you do the DJing yeah, for, yeah? Yeah. I love so, that man. I did this because I love it. I love music. My nigga, I love showing up. When are you making another baby though? Soon. I just need wait again. Give us some money. Oh, so I'm going to Zimbabwe for some reason. I want a Zimbabwean hun, you know? <laughs> but now heard. Uh, yeah, you know, you Zimbabweans are full of shit. Nah, Shona, Shona, <laughs> Shona niggas. Shona niggas. And you know me, me being one of them, we're fucking full of shit, man. <laughs> nah. You know what, guys? I'm sorry, but we're fucking full of shit. Now you are. But I've been able to keep something going on. At least me personally. Yeah, I know that. I've changed, man. I've changed. I know that. Because I'm here. Every girl is like, yeah, I'm I think I saw your status and you're like, you look hot. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> so every girl here is like, TK. I'm like, do you know Didi Wet Sang Ramatil? <laughs> She'll fuck you up. <laughs> Yo, I'm glad that you joined me here. I'm happy. For a chat. And I'm, I'm uh, happy. I can't wait for your set. The other one that's coming. Yeah. Do you know what time it's coming exactly? After these guys. After these guys. Yeah. Who is playing right now? Uh, the Sweat Kids. Sweat Kids, yeah. Sweat Kids DJs. So, well, last question, right? Before I let you go. No problem. How is the how is the relationship between uh, DJs and Gab City, right? Is it a love-hate? Is it a love or it's a hate? Is it a, okay, a stiff competition, but let the man, let the best person win. win. Like, What's the environment? Describe it for me. Um, from what I've picked, um, there are only a few, yeah? 
for me. Okay. Um, I think it's a love thing from the DJs love that I'm thing. actually in the like um, circle with. I think it's been love for me. It's been love because they that. they hook me up with gigs. So I think for me it's love, man. I love that. Yeah, it's, it's love. No hate. All right, reporting from the CBD <laughs> Vineyard Lounge, the launch. <laughs> I need you to put your hands together for my sister who yeah. is looking for a Zimbabwean man. <laughs> but I do not recommend that shit. Apart from me, because I'm the only exception. <laughs> but hey, DJ Earth. Yeah, man. <laughs> Shout out to you guys. Don't forget to vote for me. Yeah, for the Yamas. Oh, oh. Yamas. Shit. Don't yeah. forget. How do they do that? Um, the old SMS BD, BDJ. Okay. BDJ. Zero four, yeah. BDJ04 at 16106. Damn, okay. <laughs> Say that one more time slowly. Yeah, so slowly, it's yeah. BDJ. BDJ04 to 16106. Yeah, so I'm in the If, you win, that, if you win that award, right? Remember you say this shit on the Juice 2.0. I need 5% of that shit. Oh, yeah, by the way, man, I need to make a shout out. To who? To True Mother, owner of this place. Oh, yeah, sure. Shout out to my Zimba bro. What? We got this. And I'm going to take this home. Even if I don't, I mean. But the recognition for me, Yeah, man, very aggressive, uh, my sister. Man, I know, even, even in bed, my brother. Uh -uh. <laughs> but I love you all, man. <laughs> to my fans, I love you guys so much. To my mom and dad. My kids, stay amazing. It's been lovely, man. DJ Earth. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. So I'm sitting here with... An amazing patron. I can call you that, right? A patron of Vineyard Lounge. Yeah, yeah. I can. Yeah, you can. Please help me welcome Laura. How are you doing, Laura? I'm good. Cheers. It's a Cheers. toast to uh, toast to you being over at the Vineyard Lounge. Yeah. Toast to you being such a supporter of whatever is happening tonight. And toast to you having a good time. I hope you're having a good time. I am having a yeah? good time. What time did you land? Seven. 7 p.m. No, eight. Half eight, half eight. eight yeah? yeah. Is that like generally the time that you land at a spot? Yeah, I like to come late. Why? So I find people there having a good time. Oh, yeah, I don't yeah, want to yeah. stop the vibes, but find the vibes <laughs> going on. But how are you feeling though tonight? Like you're at, you're at the Vineyard Lounge launch. Wait, what's the Vineyard Lounge launch? I don't know. Yeah, we're like we're launching the lounge. Yeah. yeah. How you feel? Good. Yeah. Yeah, pretty good. It's your first time here? No, I had my birthday celebration here. Oh. Yeah. When was your birthday? 17 August. How old you turn? <laughs> ah, it's giving tits, yeah. Yeah, 30. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I couldn't have. Couldn't. Mm -hmm. have. How was your birthday experience? It was amazing. Yeah. Yeah, I had a good Why time. Why did you choose Vineyard Lounge for your birthday party? Uh, I really. It was just a new spot that I had to try out. Plus, I already knew somebody who had shown me the place. Right, right. So I was also helping, you know, promote the place a bit. That's dope. Yeah. That's dope. So tonight, it's the lounge of the restaurant. Do you feel like if you ever have to go out on a weekend, right? This is one of the first places that you have to consider coming out to? Yeah, obviously. Yeah? It's a very good place. So it's Vineyard Lounge. Give me two other places that might compete with Vineyard Lounge. Well, I barely go out, so... Why? <laughs> yo, 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 that's a lie. <laughs> I barely go out, so I'm thinking... Ioba is a place people go to, but... Right, right, right. Yeah. Okay, so Ioba. Uh, Sibili, Club Sibili. Oh yeah, Rhapsody's Bangs. That's very nice. Yeah. On, week, on, on a Saturday, it's very nice. Oh, not on a Friday. I think a Saturday is better. I've never actually been there on a Saturday. It's very nice. Sheesh, try it. man. Yeah. Have you been to the new spot, uh, Summit? No. Yeah, a lot of people actually haven't been there, yeah? Yeah, because I barely got, like I said. Dude, what are you drinking tonight? I'm having Benini Blush. Yeah? Yeah. Is that like your starter? And then shots? Yeah, and then... I'm, I'm trying to go have a shot right now. So, oh. yeah. Oh! Some tequila. Oh, you trying to get fucked up yeah, tonight? Yeah, please. Why are you trying to get fucked up tonight? 
It's been a while, so I should try just do it today. How long has it been? I haven't been fucked up like at all. I just drink yeah. to socialize. I haven't been like drunk. Have drunk. you been fucked at all? No. <laughs> <laughs> No. I'm sorry about that question. <laughs> like, <laughs> all right. So from here, is does the night end here or the night goes somewhere else? It should really end here. I think it should really yeah. end here. Dog, are you seeing someone now? The last time I checked, you're a single dog. <laughs> <laughs> I am not seeing anybody here. You single? Yes. Like situationship, nothing. Nothing. For real? <laughs> For real. Isha? I'm very sure. <laughs> I'm very sure. Okay, how's that feel though? How'd that feel? Amazing. I know, right? Yeah, it's very yeah. nice. It's like liberating. Mm hmm You get to do your own shit. Nobody's asking you like, yo, where you at? Who you with? I love that for myself right now. But don't you miss the whole lovey-dovey and shit? <laughs> I do, but there's nothing I can do at this point until I find my person. What kind of person are you looking for, though? Do you have a, a specific person? Tall? Dark. Dark? And handsome. You Americans, yo, Terrence, come over here, man. Come over here. Come over here, my brother. Just come at the, come behind me. Okay. You gotta lean down for the camera, right? Yeah. Is this what you're looking for? I mean, he's tall though, mm -hmm. and he's dark. Yes. Is he handsome? Yes. Yeah. Chinese, Chinese eyes, eyes right? <laughs> so, this is your type. Yes. He can get it. I don't know. I, I'm not looking right now, so. Okay. Mm -hmm. But this is the type, right? I mean, you're not looking now, but this is the type. Yeah. Hey, dog. Can hey, we man. trade places? I think that's true. Right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you for your services. Thank you, <laughs> that's Terrence, right? Okay. That's not, see how tall he is? Very tall. Yeah. And very dark. And you said handsome, right? Yeah. Where <laughs> now? Where's that lie? Are you a good dancer though? No. No? I can't dance. But you appreciate like the vibe, right? Yeah, I do. Like when people do that shit. Yeah, I do inside. it too. I do it too. Yeah. Dude, Laura, thank you for coming by. Yeah, you're welcome. I really appreciate you. Yes. Sir. I know you didn't want to do this because you're like, ah, the juice 2.0. <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to do this at all. But did you at least have a good time? Yeah. A I little did. bit? So video is coming up on Tuesday. Okay. Are you expecting, anticipating good things to come? Like, how how do you think you look out of this video? I just hope I don't look bad because <laughs> I didn't try too hard today. Oh, you're good. Oh, you're good. Right, gentlemen? She, she looks good, right? Yeah. Thank you. Have a great night tonight. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Laura. Are carry gusheche 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 gusheche. Ride it, ride it, my. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I need you to put your hands together for the sensation, the motherfucking celebrity B Dub. Yo, you gotta open your bottle cup <laughs> with the same. Hey, you know. Are you serious? What's up, up? What up, Papa? Perfect. How you doing? It's a big white kids. You look good. Oh, thank you, bro. You feeling good? Every time. Yeah? Every time. Dog, you blew up, dog. I wish. Fuck, no, no, no. <laughs> hey, Addy, Addy. Dog, you blew up, dog. Oh, How do you, you feel about your fame, dog? Ish. You're got getting to... late. You're getting late, I, huh? I got... <laughs> <laughs> hey, cut, 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 cut. Let's start afresh. <laughs> <laughs>
Now, let's talk about tonight, man. Yeah. Why did you come at the Vineyard Lounge? Were I you invited or you saw something I around? really support local brew. Right. Go right. everywhere. Go high on a local. Like I say, and every restaurant, I have to be there. Right, right. Yeah. I love it. Because band support, I have to do the same. For sure. Yeah. So tonight, when you walk in, mm -hmm. you're definitely one of the celebrities in B-Dub right now. How was the experience? Kind of. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> How was the experience walking in the environment? Were people trying to take pictures? Mm. Did people recognize you? Just describe that for me. It's just like a normal day, bro. Yeah. <laughs> it's that time to shine. <laughs> so, with the... You know how you blew up? You blew up because of your love of alcohol. Yeah. That's crazy. But I, got, I love alcohol with all my heart. But what's your favorite brand, though? Like, uh -uh. when you're drinking alcohol? As long as on our percentage, we are in. Rabo sir. I want a percentage, I don't want to say. shake, shake, yeah, we sir. I feel you, man. Yeah. But thank you so much for coming to the lunch. Anytime, yeah? bro. Anytime. For real. Because, yeah. uh... I think for Chuma, it means a lot of things. When people he's like my you... Friend. Yeah. Oh, he's your friend? Yeah. Oh, you guys know each other? The reason why I get a support local. Shit. <laughs> That's deep, bro. That's deep. So what are you drinking on? Alcohol. I give you a drink. I alcohol. You know they taught him, right? <laughs> they taught him PR, dogs. Because you know what? If it mentions one brand, right? They got to pay him for it. <laughs> you get it? So I asked him, like, yo, what are you drinking? He's like, ah, it's alcohol. Mm. I'm like, what's your favorite drink to drink? He's alcohol. like, alcohol. You as long as it's not a percentage, it's a shop. No, but you know what I want to know, though? Like, yeah. Did you have this knowledge about, like, branding, the business there up before you blew up? Mm -hmm. Or it's something that you learned after? Um. Or Hagi Simola. Yeah. It's something that... um. I didn't expect. Okay. COVID, COVID. COVID, yes, thank you for that. COVID, yeah. COVID, yeah. We like that guy, so I had to. Yeah, man. 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 Yeah, you Yeah, man. 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 People are supporting you. People are actually paying yeah. for your personality on certain things. And yes. This and this and that. Yeah. That's what's happening. Yes. Okay. Every day. Okay. Yeah. They're paying money. <laughs> money never been a bro. You know, we are suffering, dog, as artists. Yeah. So I actually want to know, like, are you having a different experience with, like, I don't know what's happening on my phone. We'll pick it up <laughs> after this. I want to know, like, as an influencer, because you become that. Yes, yeah. Are you happy with the compensation? Uh, uh, I won't lie. Yeah. I'm happy. Yeah. I'm really, really happy. Bro, can you buy drinks tonight? Yeah. Yeah? Bill on me. Hey! O open bar. <laughs> <laughs> Anything. What, what you feeling? Hennessy. Get it. XO, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so did you just get here or it's been a couple of hours? I have about uh, two hours, yeah. Two hours. Yeah. What are you hoping or what kind of, you know, vibe are you hoping for tonight? This is the perfect vibe I want. Yeah. Banyana. No. Fapo wakata. We've been, yeah. we've been craving this vibe, bro. For sure. Then we leave. But vibe on vibe yabo conka, vibe yabo conka dog. Vibe yabo IP AP. Yeah. You get. So you don't say about us. From what? 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 So we're still over here at the lounge, man. We're launching Vineyard Lounge right here in the Massa building at the back of Massa. Brand new restaurant alert. And if you wanted a spot to chill at over on a Monday, over on a Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, you come over here, man, for some great drinks. Food menu is also just quite delicious and tasty. 
So you come over here at Vineyard. But for the purposes of tonight, because you're launching and we're having conversation with the patrons, put your hands together and help me welcome Star. How are you doing, Star? Hi, 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 TK. How, you doing? How are you? I'm good. I'm How are good. you? I'm good. I'm amazing. So, as you can see, I'm here. Yeah, but hey, <laughs> and you're pretty lit right now. And I'm so lit, but I'm lit looking lit. So, <laughs> there's How a long, level to that. How long have you been here? I've been here for like, this is my first time here. Oh, first here time at the Vineyard? Seven. Yeah. Oh, shit. So, I like exploring new places in Botswana. Who told you about the vineyard? I saw it through people's statuses, honestly. Yeah. And I was like, I want to go there. I want to go there and just chill and have my own vibe. Oh, yeah. So I literally came here and I got that vibe. I love that. I love it. I love the DJ lineup Ooh. on top of everything. I love the DJ lineup. It's pretty hard, isn't it? How can you guys just stand with Bunny? How do you do that? That's too fire, bro. Bunny's hard, bro. Bunny's hard, bro. God damn it. So <laughs> he what? got me off my seat. So what are you? Are you R&B, hip hop, or you, I'm a piano? I'm an R&B and hip hop girl. OK. I'm your Cassie girl, and she's dating Diddy. <laughs> That's me, yeah? Until I'm Diddy, until Diddy fucked her up. And I know I'm so young to be listening to that type of music, but right. yeah, I listen to Wait, it and I love are you, it. How old are you, Star? I'm 22, guys, going on 23. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. When is your birthday? I mean, when is your it's birthday? It's on the 20th of September. It's my birthday, oh! mom. Happy birthday to me. September kids. <laughs> so you guys better be open, because I'm going to be balling yeah by my birthday i'm gonna be balling the whole botana's gonna know man i get it's 2.2 million people sister bettina <laughs> sister bettina is on right now Bele, Bele. I la national anthem south african national anthem that's crazy you don't remix that song you'll die Go. as a dj who did you who did you come here with i came here alone oh yeah. where's your boyfriend actually <laughs> Where's my boyfriend? He's at home. Oh. <laughs> He's sleeping at his house. He let you go out alone? Then why wouldn't he let me? Uh, why? Uh, it's not make sure. He's not supposed to not let me go out. He met me when I was going out. So he doesn't have a problem with you going out alone? Even if he has a problem, it's his problem. It's not mine. Hey, yo. <laughs> it's not mine. Not, I will go. I'm 22, bruh. Yeah. So imagine I'm dating. My boyfriend is like 33 years old. He's 33 years old. He's trying to settle down. Fine. I'm in a committed relationship with him. Right, right. But I'm not like, trying to hold down my youth. I want to dance. I want to twerk. I want to open a 180. Do you I get feel you. it? I yeah, feel you. I'm still young, man. So do you Even like if it? he dumps me tomorrow, I'll get a new nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I got a new nigga. It's so simple. I'm so Why? Young. Why are you so confident that you get a new nigga? Have you met me? <laughs> Have you met me? Hey yo. <laughs> Have you seen me? <laughs> yo, Star, you're pretty right wild now, though. Right now, I'm working for a company. I'm a makeup artist, right? Okay. I'm working for a company called Mountain Avenue. It's a tattooing company. Right, right. The whole time we have a store at Consumer Affairs, right now, from Monday till Sunday. Right, right. I've been showing my face there every day. And I've been calling people out. What does my face? So imagine with my body what I would be doing. <laughs> with your body? Imagine. What? I said imagine. I didn't say I'm using my body. I said imagine. Imagine. <laughs> what would you get up to with your body, though? Nah, not that much. I'm too shy for that shit, bruh. You don't come out like that, though. I know. I'm so confident, but I'm so, I'm such a, I have social anxiety. Doc, have you ever cheated on your boyfriend? No. No? I don't like cheating. Oh. Because when you cheat, as, as, as I am, I'm a girl, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have my own insecurities. So when you cheat on me, you're telling me that I'm not enough. Ah. So if you cheat on me as my boyfriend, you're telling me I'm not enough for you, so go fuck off and go fuck that bitch and be with that bitch. Because clearly you deserve her. And you don't deserve me. So hey, that's yo. me. Don't bring down my self-esteem because you're trying to boost your own ego. No. So how are you, how are you treating uh, the brothers that are trying to get with you tonight? They better work for it. Yeah? How did, how, did they, how did they work for it? 
I don't know how that to work. You just gotta show up, my nigga, and show off. And just show off. Hey, yo. Because better when you show off, I'm gonna pull up. So, if you pull up, right, don't you care about the guy, the guy at home? Your boyfriend? Which guy? Your boyfriend? My boyfriend? Yeah. Oh, no, I wouldn't pull up on any nigga if okay. I'm with my man. Okay. Right now, I have a man. That's why I'm not pulling up on niggas. I don't even cheat. I won't fuck anyone. I won't kiss anyone. For me, cheating is fucking and kissing, guys. Flirting is a whole different game. Stop. Hey, guys. Stop. Stop. I, get, I get guys who fucking bless me and give me money because they can say hi to me. So imagine I say no to a lot of highs. I will. <laughs> so, so what was like the big? What was the the biggest blessing you ever got from a guy? Thirty thousand rands. There was a point where I was in South Africa. Um, this is last year, right? I was in South Africa. I lost my phone in a club. <laughs> but... I was using a six plus. Mind you. Mind hey, you? Hey, yeah. hey, hey, I'm I brave, I'm I'm brave. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, I lost my phone in a club because I was too drunk. Honestly, I was drunk. I didn't lose it, I forgot it. Right, right, right. It wasn't stolen, it was taken. Right. Yeah. Like, they had a long ass time to like, recover their phone and everything. Fine. So, I text my guy, hey? I'm like, babe, I can't tell him I lost my phone. I'm like, babe, uh, my phone is not working. <laughs> it just went silent. <laughs> and then? <laughs> and I'm texting him with my friend's phone. Yeah, yeah. I Don't forget you, the mic. Don't forget the mic. I think you interviewed her. You interviewed her, my friend Tina. Oh! Yeah, I was texting my boyfriend with Tina's phone. So I'm like, you and Tina friends? Yeah, we were friends back then. Now we're not friends. What happened? And okay, well, in the no, open. we'll talk. We'll talk we about it. We can tell you what happened. No, we'll I'm, talk about it. We'll talk about let it. Let me finish what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I saw this guy with Tina's phone. I'm like, ah, dog. I lost my phone. It's not working. It just shut down. It didn't shut down though. I lost it. And he's like, okay, fine, babe. What you need? I'm like, I need money for a new phone. Like, okay, fine, go into the Apple store and tell me how much it is you need on your cart. I'm like, cool. My nigga, I added my phone, I added headphones, I added some cards, I added. <laughs> it amounted up to like 30,000 rands. And then I send him a screenshot and it's like, okay, cool. What? Okay, cool. Okay, cool. <laughs> Yo, brothers. And I was like, okay. Yeah, hold on, hold on. <laughs> brothers, let's work hard. <laughs> Please, you should work hard. <laughs> my brothers, my brothers in the struggle, you got a good girl. Money is very important, man. Let's it's work a, hard. Let's, let's thank work you. hard. Yeah. <laughs> and then? So and then I tell him, it's 30,000 rands. Mind you, we have a high currency rate here for in sure, Southern sure. Africa, right? Botswana has the most powerful currency here in, in, in Af Southern Africa. Right, right. I call him, I'm like, baby, it has 30,000 rands. He's like, okay, sure. He sends 30,000 pula. <laughs> pula. And that's like 40,000 rands. It reported to me as 40,000 rands. I cashed it immediately all off. I want my money. Hey, yo, what'd you do with that money? Did you I get a phone? phone. You I got a phone? phone. Right I here. My phone. But this is my not, phone this is not. Like, my phone was like 26,000. Yeah, yeah. Rents. Yeah. I have, I have interest from the pullers and everything. I went out, started shopping, everything. I started shopping for, well, I have a man. <laughs> so what is this guy? Is this South African? Is this South African? Surprisingly. Guys. <laughs> B -dub. You guys don't know, B -dub. but Botswana, a lot of Botswana men have money, a lot. The problem is, URS. They can't express it, they can't flex because of URS. Hey, yo, <laughs> <laughs> And I 
friends that shit. Be your ass up. Ah, bro. I got it first hand. And none of you guys can know who my man is because I was exclusive like that. But is he, is he a well-known guy? Very. He's trended before I trended. Damn. <laughs> but look, say, I'm happy for you. Thank you. I'm happy for you. I mean, I got a bag. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, I mean. Even though I have a bag right now, I'm no longer with the bag, though, because we have different things. Because I noticed he can give me money for groups, but he can't give me money for my business. So oh, I was yeah, like, fuck yeah, him, fuck yeah. him. Yeah. But what is, is that? It, is in if you're not growing me and you're not making me become the next best mixing makeup or something, and I'm in that line, then what are you doing? If you don't grow me, you're making me come minute. I don't want that. You better grow me and make me a superstar. I'm going to become the next Fenty. I feel you. Yeah, exactly. I feel you. Yeah, so if you don't grow me, then what are we doing? I'm sapiosexual, hey? I can date a nerd anytime. I'll date a nerd because why? They're educating me every day. They're teaching me something new every day. That's what I like, learning something new. Yo, Star, you're pretty wild, bro. I know. God damn it. <laughs> like, so, this guy, right? Is he in B-Dub or is he in South Africa? He's in, right now, he's in B-Dub, guys. Right now? And he's from B-Dub. He lives here. This is his home. When he sees this, he's gonna laugh. And so is the girlfriend. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> hey, yo. Do you hear that? Do you hear that? She's no, 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 wait, 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 wait. She just said, when he sees this, he's gonna he's laugh. He's gonna laugh about it. And so? And so is the girlfriend. I repeat it. She's gonna laugh about it because she knows me. At this point, she knows me. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> Hey yo! Hey yo! <laughs> <laughs> hey yo! What the fuck is going on? Shut up, bro. Said. It's the city. That's how it is in the city. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so, okay. But you guys don't so know a know, lot of things you know that girlfriend? happens in the city. You know her girlfriend? No. I mean, his girlfriend. Okay, this is what happened. For me to know that he has a girlfriend, I didn't know. I honestly didn't know that he had a girlfriend. Okay. The whole time we're hanging out, we're doing stuff. He's not giving that vibe. You know, someone who has a girlfriend would have to go home at a certain point. He would have to receive a call at some point. He wasn't doing that. So I thought, yeah, well, it's me and me alone. Until I realized and I'm like, whoa. <laughs> And me realizing this, it was before Summit was Summit and it was Cigar. Yeah, right, 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 right. I pull up, the on that, you know that VIP area? The Section, one yeah, there, yeah. I'm in this one. I'm in this VIP, the one low. <laughs> I pull up there and I'm like, this is my man. <laughs> that is so my man. And I stare at him. Do you know that long, consistent stare whereby I'm telling you, do you see me? And you say, yeah, I see you. We had that stay. Do you know what the girlfriend did? What? Stepped in front, right in front, and sat on his laps to show me who's boss. I'm like, fuck this shit. She showed you, huh? She showed you, huh? <laughs> and I never knew there was another girl above me. He never At told you, time. right? He never yeah. told you, yeah. Fuck! It's sad, it's sad. That's why I let go of him. Because even after all that shit, I forgave him. But then he's like going on with it. And I'm like, dude, you can't be fucking everyone in the city. You're going to get me sick or you're going to get sick. So I, I, mean, just want I mean, you got to be scared about yeah, that shit. Yeah, that's right? when I left. I'm like, fuck the money. I don't need the money. But at least you got your 14. My third in pro, baby. It was worth 25,000 rands cash, guys. You want to show him? You want to show him? I swapped that shit. You want to show him? I swapped this shit, hey? I swapped this shit. <laughs> <laughs> you want to tell me I owe, owe, so, owe so bills? Oh, bills, you, why? Star, would you even date it? Would you even date a... I can't date a Mutwana guy right now. I can't. Because he set the, the standard too high. 
the bar is too high for Batana men right now. I can't. That's why you remember earlier on you passed by me and like, where are you? Why are you hiding? That's why I'm not everywhere. Yeah, all the men here, they can't, can't keep up with me. So why we get me? We're, We're just, just having fun. fun. We don't care. We'll we'll see. So what we did now? That's how it's supposed to be. Living what? Living young and wild and free. Hey. So why we get. Hey, hey. But yo, dog, you know you gotta chill, right? I know, I've chilled. No, you haven't. Ah, star dog. When was the when was the last time you saw me trending in the streets or something? When okay. was the last time you saw me besides today? Apart from social media. It's been social a minute. Social media exactly. It's been a minute. Exactly. I keep to myself now. Because after experiencing the groove of South Africa, I can't groove here. That's why I came here today on a solo date. And then my girls decided, because I'm on a solo date, they can come join me. Fine. That's not a problem. So when was the last time you got laid? It's been a minute. I mean... <laughs> Guys, my man fucks me, the man I have right now fucks me. But it's been a minute because huh, I need a distance, eh? I need some time off. <laughs> Yo, I can tell you this. Oh, go ahead. I can tell you this, man. Gap City, <laughs> Gap City, it's really Sin City, right? But I've never cheated on my man. The guy I'm dating now, I'm dating now. I've never cheated on him. No, but he's got a wife, though. No. Oh, he's got a girl. That's the guy who bought me this phone. We're done. We're over because he started fucking the whole of Gabs. What's and his name? He, What's his name? I can't do that. What's his name? I can't disclose that. Too private. <laughs> and I know you know him, so I'm not going to tell him. you know him. Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh shit. Yo, Star. I'm not gonna tell you. <laughs> I need you to look in the camera and say, My name is Star and I'm at the Vineyard Lounge. I should say my name. Yeah, in the camera. Hi. The mic, the mic, the mic, the mic. Hi, my name is Naledi and I'm at the Vineyard. If you guys wanna pull through, pull through. It's the next happening spot for you know. real. <laughs> Yo. Put your hands together for her. I was I, I wasn't I wasn't even looking for juicy <laughs> like that, but But I gave it to you. Yeah. What's going on, YouTube? My name is TK of the Juice 2.0. I'm just here to say thank you very much for checking our video and click subscribe, like, and the notification button for more content just like that.